Congratulations, guys. What a strong story. Wow. Um, one phrase really stuck out to me when Rex was saying, um, learning by living, everything else is a lie. Could you both relate to that in the world we live in today? I mean, it's a strong statement. You can learn things from books, too. But yes, I do think a yeah. lot of good teaching comes from living. Yeah, I, I kind of agree with that manner of, uh, of education. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, because I mean, the world we live in today is like full of lies. So it's very kind of strong. Anyway, Jeanette um, was saying about you, Brie, said you're a very fearless woman. Um, are you like a fearless woman in real life, too? <laughs> Um, yeah, I think so. I mean, to be clear, I still feel fear. I'm not immune to that feeling. I just don't let fear stop me. Was it hard for you to play a real life person? Were you nervous? I, well, I was nervous until I spoke with Jeanette and then she immediately diffused any fears that I had because she told me that she didn't need me to play some sort of like perfect imitation of her mm -hmm. that she would be available to answer any question that I had and no question was too personal but ultimately she just wanted me to tell the truth so mm -hmm. take everything in as I could but then make it real make it true and don't try and focus so much on getting everything exactly as it was but instead give the authentic version mm -hmm. of what I had in the moment. Woody, Rex is a dreamer um, rather than realizing his dreams really. What was your biggest dreams when you were growing up and did you follow them? Um, mm. I used to dream about being a secret service agent but then that passed when I realized the character that I liked on television was actually an actor playing a secret <laughs> service agent. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so I did. I wanted to be a, an actor from fairly young not as young as Bree, you know, I was like, um, actually, actually, I was in college by the time I really thought that's what I wanted to do with my life. Okay. Uh, but luckily, I didn't become a Secret Service agent. I'd be having to protect Donald Trump right now, and that just wouldn't sit well. <laughs> no, you would have a very big job right now to do. <laughs> yeah, I'd be wanting to slip him some cyanide instead of oh jumping in God. front of a bullet, a bullet. I shouldn't say these you things. should probably. not be saying these okay, things. Okay, well, I guess, no. well, there, it's out there, it's no. out there. Very quick, um, um, Rex gave his children stars and planets um, for Christmas. What was your best Christmas present you ever got from your parents? Oh my gosh, that's a great question. That is a good question. I remember there was this show called The Big Comfy Couch. Um, it was my favorite show on TV, and there was a doll on the show named Molly, and it was like the thing to get was the Molly doll. It was kind of like the Tickle Me Elmo of its time. Uh, and I remember that Christmas so well because I wanted it, um, didn't think I was going to get it. And I think my mom did the whole like, oh, we're not going to be able to find it. It's too hard. <laughs> and I remember that year so well because I, I was sick. I had like the flu and a really bad fever. And I came downstairs and that Molly doll was there. And it was like game over. Didn't need to open nice. anything else. That was it. Those are the moments when, you know, you really go like, oh, my God, my parents are heroes. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's great. Woody? I got a typewriter. That was about my favorite gift that I got. Because I always wanted a typewriter. I don't know why. I think typewriters type. are cool. <laughs> but yeah, this is back when you use typewriters. Now, there's probably a lot of people who are saying, what is he saying? A, a type what? What's that? Is that there's an iPhone? Young people, <laughs> in, anyone under 30, they're like, what's a typewriter? <laughs> I don't know what a typewriter is. It's how we used to make our papers and so. Great, thank you so much. Congratulations on a wonderful performance. Thank you. Bye to Thank London. you. Thank you. Bye. Bye.